Hello guys. So in this video, we'll be discussing that what we have to do in week three. So if you have gone through the suggestions which I have done for the first week one and week two, you must have realized that the best way to learn it is to practice varieties of uh, sets. Also remembering some of the tricks, approaches and structure which, which you must have gone through the previous sets. We use those as an experience for the upcoming sets, right? So in the week three, my suggestion is that you should focus on set theory and Venn diagram because this is a very, very important uh, section through which sets have appeared, regularly sets have appeared in the recent CAT, right? Now, the good thing about this particular topic is that we have mathematical formula for it, right? So those things have already been covered in the theory videos. You can go through it and you must have gone through those in the school days that if there are three sets, we draw the Venn diagram this way, right? Suppose this is A, B, and C. And we have the formula that the number of A union, B union, C is nothing but number of A plus number of B plus number of C, right? Uh, then minus A intersection B plus B intersection C plus C intersection A. And at the end, we add the intersection of A and B and C, right? So this is a a uh, well-known formula i believe that we must have gone through it in the in the school days if not then definitely these are already been discussed in the theory videos right so this is a straight away formula when we discuss the basic questions from the venn diagram which have three variables right but in the logical reasoning sections you will not be getting such sets you will also be getting sets which have more than three variables right apart from that there is a variety of maxima and minima that is also we need to get a right so for maxima and minima i have developed a trick uh, the theory is also available into it and in the coming live session we'll be discussing at length because in this we not only for depend upon the formula which we use or the or the approach we use we also use the boundary conditions to arrive at the solutions so you have to focus on 10 to 15 sets the time required would remain the same it will uh, if you want to do it in depth and definitely you have to give it at least 20 to 25 hours in this particular week and the number of sets should be 10 to 15 again the LOD should be easy to moderate there are a couple of difficult sets available in set theory which are very very difficult so just hold those set for a while once you are thorough with the uh, all three or four varieties from the Venn diagram then we'll be discussing some of the difficult sets in the live session so you will be able to handle it right now the key focus area is very very important as i said that this particular topic has a mathematical formula so obviously you need to understand what is the formula and how to apply the formula in the given set right apart from that since the questions which appear for maximum and minima uh, which require which which can be applied for multiple variable right the trick is not limited for the application of three variable it can apply it for multiple variable if there are four or five or six variables then also we can apply that you know, apply that particular trick. But in CAT, usually the question have appeared for three to four variables only, right? Now, important thing about the set theory and Venn diagram is that once you read the set, immediately after just going through the first few uh, first few statements, you identify that this question is from Venn diagram of set theory. Why so? Because the questions, the framing of the question or the framing of the set has a unique characteristic, right? You'll be finding a lot of phrases like at least one, exactly one, not all or only two such are the phrases they uh, it is used not only in the sets but in the, the conditions also so the correct interpretation correct logical interpretation of all these words is very very necessary because if you make one mistake in understanding any of these phrases then definitely you'll be getting the wrong answer for sure and as i said that there are multiple variable uh, questions in the set theory so one very uh, important type of Venn diagram question up here, which has four variables. So it has a unique structure, which I have explained in the solutions of uh, uh, of the sets, which required for four variable. So do go through the same. I will also be discussing on the live session uh, for those people who have not understood it. And we'll be taking some uh, questions which have appeared in CAT, which required for uh, which required the structure, which we use for four, uh, four variable Venn diagram that also we'll be discussing. So this is the target which you have to do for the week three. And I'll again emphasize that this topic is very, very important. This is not only important for CAT, but it is also important for non-CAT exams. Now, let me show you that where you will be finding these sets. If you have purchased only CAT DLR comprehensive course, so you'll be finding in this particular bundle. And if you have purchased the complete course, you'll be finding in that bundle, right? So what you have to do is that this particular topic comes in data interpretation section. So you have to go to this particular folder 
Once you go into it and you'll be finding the second part, this you can see that Venn diagram in set theory. So I have given 15 to 20 sets, I think I have given 20 sets. So uh, the there are five difficult sets and rest are easy to moderate. So what you have to do is that you have to solve all the easy and moderate sets. And some people ask me that, sir, uh, uh, and some of you were finding very difficult to find where are the video solutions. So let me explain you that once you go into this, you will take it as a test. There is no time limit into it. You take your own time, just put the answers, whatever you come across, right? Here is the thing wherein you'll be getting all the questions specific to this particular sets. And once you're done, you have to submit it. Once you submit, then you will be taken to the solution part, right? So this particular, uh, uh, this button you have to click. So it will give you the, it will, uh, it will uh, bring you again to the set, but for with the correct answers etc and here is the explanations and please remember that this particular set has say four questions so you don't get four different videos the first very first video itself has the solution for all the four questions